what's going on, guys? Welcome to. Let's <laughs> drop the camera. We are currently in San Antonio with uh, Bizzle. We're filming today. We got Heidi, we have Ash over here, and I've got some breakfast. I have three whole eggs with a serving of fat free cheese, three quarters of a cup of oatmeal with one massive scoop of peanut butter. If I were to use my, my macro and food volume knowledge, I'd probably say about a serving and a half. Some syrup, this is a little light syrup, and then some pink salt on everything. I think it's on, it's on manual focus. I'm gonna show you everything I ingest today as well as just sort of vlog throughout the day. So it should be a fun video. Sit back, relax, and here's the intro. What was that? <laughs> yeah. You know when you haven't like cut your hair and like the week too long and you just don't have like your trimmer, you feel kind of like bleh. That's how I feel like I look right now. Just vibes. Vibes. Sick vibes. I love it. This thing right here, not low calorie, but you know what? Like winter is coming. And winter is coming. This is bulking season. I'm not gonna be trying to gain half a pound every month. I am looking to gain weight this bulk, put muscle on as much as I possibly can, because I don't really, it's not like a big deal for me to shed off a few extra pounds at the end of my bulk. So, grande white chocolate. It means full fatty mode. <laughs> no whip, I don't really like whipping my drinks, but this is delicious. Do you think people are gonna have questions? I was, I'm like, I'm not gonna be super careful. Like, I don't, I'm not tracking macros. And I, not that I say you shouldn't track macros, depends on like your body type and like yeah. how you gain weight and stuff. But for me, like I struggle to gain. Like, I was 189 at one point, now I'm back like 184. Like, cause just I haven't been eating that much. So it's like my weight, if I don't keep at it, keep at it, keep at it, and keep like increasing my food, then I, I literally will just lose weight. Mm -hmm. It's my genetics. And that's why I can diet on 300 grams of carbs, like the whole prep, which have a fast metabolism. I think that's a lie, like two, I think I got a little low for a few weeks, like 240, but that's still pretty high compared to a lot of people. And be like, how much do I have to pay you to drink this whole thing of maple syrup? In like one go, I can chug it. 200 uh, bucks? Nah. 250. Bro. That's so much sugar. You'll feel like crap, it's 250, bro. We're training at UFC gym today here in San Antonio. This morning, I'm like, oh, all right, we're gonna film this video. We didn't film yesterday, like we're just gonna knock it out, like do all this stuff, and Man, then like life happens, it's just like the work's happening, it's kind of stressful and I'm kind of like out of my element here. I've been out of town for, you know, the whole New York trip and then San Antonio, I've been here for a few days now. So it's just like, it gets kind of hard not being home just because so much of the business needs like attending to, like I have to be there physically. And uh, I think I sort of build up stress like when I'm, I'm just not home for a while. I notice a trend as the, the length of duration where I'm gone like increases, my stress kind of increases, I feel like kind of helpless, like can't do much. And then it's like, all right, time to lift, but it's like all this stuff's going on in my head, my phone's blowing up, can't do it, you know what I mean? So it's kind of like a repeating cycle of like, ugh. But when Heidi moves in, things are gonna change a lot. We're gonna have everything in one place. I know when she comes to Houston, and it's the same for her, like she can't do as much when everything's just so scattered. So I'm just really excited to have everything under one roof. I mean, we, we live three and a half hours away. Like, and we're doing, you know, we've been doing that for two years now. So it's just almost like having two homes, but then kind of just not having it all, and then business is here, and then we travel a lot and stuff. So I'm just really excited. That's like on my mind right now. Like, you know what, people were like commenting about the price of this backpack. We priced this backpack at $82, and Oh my God, it's so expensive. And this is the most expensive item we've ever produced like for us, for me to actually make. But I challenge you to go find a backpack that's $82 better than, this is the best quality. You will not find anything. A Jansport cloth backpack is like 50 bucks. Plain cloth, which some people want, that's fine. But like this is a premium backpack. And if you look in the market, of premium backpacks. If you go look at douchebags, if you go look at just something with this quality build, the materials, the custom molding, like custom zippers and stuff, you're not looking at a $50 backpack. I just, I hate when people talk crap, because it's like, man, you don't know what's going into this. And a lot of work, you know, but <laughs> check this out. BCAs, got the pre, got the pump. To be honest, my training hasn't been the best this last week of travel, but as I kind of explained, like with my calories, my calories are going up, like the winter months are coming, and this is when I'm really actually excited to build muscle, because I feel like I can just eat a lot, I'm gonna train heavy, I'm gonna focus on progressive overload, and just have really good workouts. Like I'm not gonna look the best in the mirror, but like this is the time where I'm gonna be building the majority of the muscle that I'm gonna be building for the bulk, I guess, if that makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go, no stress, no stress. No stress. Here, I'm ready, I'm breathing all the stress in. Ready? 
just exhaled all that stress, bro. It's gone. All right, enjoy the edit. <laughs> you gonna go back? Nope. <laughs> not bad, right? That's not bad at all. Let's get back to the end. <laughs> Zeke update with the pump on, with the good lighting. We're here in the octagon. <laughs> Sick. The octagon dirty. I'd say right now in the morning I'm probably 185 ish, maybe 186. Depends how much I eat the night before. Chest, left arm, right arm. Are you ready? Oh, you look so sweet. What you Yeah, yeah, yeah. He said he's talking about a chick, so. <laughs> Here's a bleak, so yes. It's like kind of there. Yeah, <laughs> no, we're not, we not a normal seven year old. No, we not. I love it. Yeah. We not like little 7 Eleven that's all quiet and ah. Uh... <laughs> How are you, right. man? Good, how are you? Good, good. Hey, nice to meet you. Yeah, yeah, you sure. You guys want some snacks? Yes. Oh my god, yes. yes. Oh, everyone. Oh. Oh. Do you want to work out? Oh, salt vinegar. What I'm going to do post workout. I've got one, actually, I got two protein shakes. I don't have any ghosts with me. I would normally do two scoops of ghost protein after my workout. These have 26 grams of protein, 28 carb a piece. So you're looking, let's see, 480 calories with these two. I got myself some pineapple chunks from 7 Eleven. Oh my God, you get your fruit from a gas station? That's so gross. Pineapple, it's good for the uh, health. And I got some apples and grapes. Okay, some micros, more micros. And then to top it off, I got myself a naked juice. I'm a big fan of naked juice. I've talked about this before. Here's all the uh, some micros. Here's kind of what's in the juice. I'm getting my protein in here, and uh, honestly, a lot of calories. This is probably like, let's see, 270. I don't, I don't know. I'll put the calories on the screen. Oh, actually, I found. These are the best. Favorite trips ever. Whole bag. Oh, bit my lip. 15 fat, 60 carb. The air Six is thinner as we climb. We've only got one destination. Touch the clouds and gravity's edge, and the rest is our momentum. Does it matter if I can't breathe out there? I've got memories of where we began, and you won't follow my silhouette. The grows bigger towards the sun I can see your darkened eyes Perfect. Hasn't been the best full day of eating, right? Been out of town. I was like, you know what? We need some groceries. So, how do you order some groceries? We're having really healthy food to end the day. This is my second to last meal. To make up for the, uh, 
<laughs> oh my god, it stinks. I think there's lumps in here. Kill. Go. But it stinks. Oh Do my god. Alright, ready? <laughs> oh. <coughs> oh yeah. What? Who are you? Do you want some watermelon to chase it? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that is literally the most foul tasting powder, which is why I have uh, It's so bad. But honestly, I'm surprised you didn't throw up. Wow, I did watering. That was terrible. <laughs> Still there. No, I put it, I put half a teaspoon one time in a shake, and I, it, the whole shake smelled like that. I couldn't drink it. Yeah, I saw how much you put. Oh, it just came back. <laughs> it says one teaspoon. I did know. you get how much I did? Yeah. You did like, that was like two tablespoons. <laughs> Uh, I probably did like 10 grams of fiber in that. Uh, let me show you my dinner. <laughs> got about six ounces of chicken. Got some green beans. Heat it up on the pan. I've never seen a bag like this. One frozen unopened bag in the microwave. What are you doing that? I was doing that. I've never seen you do that. It's a weird bag. These have been my go-to sweet potatoes since summer shredding. Three servings here. You're looking at 45 grams of carbs, six grams of fiber. Uh, just like that. Maybe I can stomach food more than me. I can have you can't, you won't. It's like whiskey. Oh my god, I'm so. Are you looking at your smile? <laughs> Alright, it's now about 11.45. I'm going to have my final meal for the day. I've got about six to seven ounces of ground turkey. <laughs> that's that's word out really weird. <laughs> uh, some buffalo sauce. Uh, I would either use buffalo or some light sodium soy sauce today. I'm feeling the buffalo. I'm not the best at measuring rice by eye, like eyeballing it, but I'd say about a cup and a half or two cups of jasmine rice. And that's literally my final meal. Uh, this is going to put me right at my protein. My carbs are super high. My fat's under 100 grands. So that's like a pretty good day for me. So I want to thank you all so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Give it a thumbs up. And we'll see you in the next